line, right? Correct. And you're, and let's say you're the main progenitor. You're the, you're the, you're the father. You're the, gotcha. Right. And you talk to your family. Is it going to have to be displayed to you or to your family that they're the ones that are going to be the beneficiaries of what you inherited? Yeah, but that's the Old Testament. No, hold on. Like, y'all, y'all dropped the ball. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, I'm, I'm not talking about. I'm not talking okay, about Old Testament. Right, right. I'm just giving. A, I'm, I'm giving a statement to you. Would it be? Would it be fair to say if you have a family and you're, and you're the progenitor, you are the father, you're the you're the you're the head honcho, mm -hmm. right? You got sons and daughters, sons and daughters, and you're going to leave your will. Right. To your to your offspring, all right. Even those who aren't even in your your, your city, let's so gotcha. say. You're talking about lineage. You're talking about like a bingo. bloodline. Gotcha. Bingo, bingo, all right. So, so, they're, so those... they're the ones that are invited to the wedding, right? Hold on. But didn't they not get there? So he had to go to the streets and go to the highways and go to the hold byways. On. Hold on, because y'all yeah, dropped the ball. Y'all killed Jesus hold too. On. Hold on, hold on. You gotta slow down, man. Let's, right, let's take it slow. Right, so when you when you speak about the the, the lineage, right? Mm -hmm. the lineage. Where does it say that the Lord changed and he said he's going to accept everybody now? Numbers 14, 21, John okay. 1, 10, okay. um, Matthew 25, 26. Okay. But let's start with Numbers 14, 21 first. Ahead, because that says you dropped the ball 10 times because of that is coming to everybody. He's going to give his glory to the whole earth. So if, so if you want to read that, please. You said Numbers 14? And yeah, but we start at 19 for the content. Okay. Uh, numbers 14 and uh and you're talking about y'all. Okay, we're talking about who? Y'all, y'all. Right. Israelites, right? Oh, y'all. Y'all, y'all, gotcha. Uh, you. Right. This is Moses. This is Moses praying for y'all because y'all keep dropping the ball. So this is what Moses is about to say. It? Yeah, yeah, read it. Can't. All right, Numbers 14 and 19. Pardon, I beseech thee. This is Moses. The iniquity of this people you according, guys. according right. unto the greatness of thy mercy. I'm talking to the Most High. As right. thou hast forgiven this people. From Egypt, Egypt even correct, until ready? now. Watch, watch and the this. Lord said, I have pardoned according to thy word. Mm -hmm. But as truly as what? I live, as I live what? because these people Hold did on. what? Hey, 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 hey. But as truly as I live, and God all the Lord. earth what? shall be filled mm -hmm. with the glory of the Lord. Because why? Right. Because y'all because because dropped the ball because because ten times. Israel was scattered all, all no, the world. No, no, no. Let's read what the Bible yeah, says. Reading, why? Why? Because, verse 22. Because all those men mm -hmm. which have seen my glory and my miracles, which I did in Egypt mm -hmm. and what? in the wilderness, what do they do? and have tempted me now these right. ten times, right. and have yeah, not hearkened to my voice. Right. So, and so what does the most high do? He sends Christ. Right? Joshua, what First Joshua, John 10 says he went to his own, his own receiver. Right, we see the night. But y'all dropped the ball. Can you Joshua and yes. Caleb. Why were Joshua and Caleb the only ones that went over to the land? Well, Caleb isn't a bloodline Israel. Well, who's, uh, who's, who's Caleb's father? Uh, who is it? I don't, I don't know where I'm talking. They never mentioned it for that sake. Fair enough. So, he, 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 so. No, Joshua, that's, that's Joshua and Caleb, right? They, the, Lord, the Lord has Israel going around for 20 years. He killed off that generation of people because they were wicked. Correct. Right. So, coming back full circle to the children of Israel. Correct. And that no, no, no. Put, the Israelites. Come, come, coming back full circle to Israel. Because Israel's coming different back, coming than back. the Israelites. Anybody could be Israel. No. Isaiah 56, bring it out. Come on. Isaiah, Pull out Isaiah 56 and 1 King 8. Anybody could be the house of Israel. You said what? Isaiah what? Isaiah 56. Read it. Uh, uh, Isaiah 56? Anybody could be the house of Israel. So that's anybody. Anybody could wait, be wait a minute. Wait a minute. How is, how is that that's possible? No, wait. Read it. Read it. Let me ask you a question. So that means anybody, anybody can be the son of Israel? Could be the house No, the son. No, it doesn't no yeah. that's the son of Jacob you're talking about. Yeah, well, Jacob Those are the is Israelites. Israel. Y'all are the sons of Jacob. Who was Jacob? Jacob is is he's an Israelite. He's the he's the father of the Israelites. Right. Correct. So, so, so that's how, not the house and of Israel. You, in order in order to be an Israelite, you got to come out of the lineage and to be an Israelite. Jacob. Not to be the house of Israel. Read, read, brother. Read it. Read what? Read Isaiah 56. Look, the whole chapter. No, just read Isaiah 56. Start at three. Look, guys, listen, listen, listen. listen. Go ahead, go ahead. Read it. Look, look. I, I can take my sword out. Take it out. Y'all are Israelites. Y'all ain't the house of Israel. What's the difference? What's the difference? The difference is you got to be born again. You got to kill the old man. You got to convert. Then you become. Okay. So how does one convert? By killing the old man. Okay, how does by not smoking how, weed, how, by not selling okay, drugs, so, so, cheating. So, you know all right, so killing the old man will now make you of the house of Israel or an it, Israelite? It, well, actually, it makes you go through Christ now, no, which Christ question, is the gate. But the question is, 
the killing of the old man makes does you the house of Israel. Makes you the house of correct. Israel. Correct. Yes. So yes. how can you be the house of Israel if what? you don't come out of the seed of Israel? Because that's an Israelite. That's not the house of Israel. It's totally different. It's not. Yes, it is. There's no difference. There's no difference. Hold on, brother. Being being the house of Israel, that means the house of Israel are made up of who? Israelites. No, it's made up of whoever converts. The children of Israel. Why? Well, let's let God say. He got to sort out. Let him. Let him go. Let him go ahead. Let him go ahead. Ready? Isaiah 56. Isaiah 56 in verse 3 you said, right? No, already. Um, neither let the son of the stranger, is that an Israelite? Yes. Really? Yes. Then let's go to 1 Kings 8 then, so we can yes. squash that. Right. Right. Israelites that's were strangers. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but, Israelites but, but were strangers. All right? They were strangers. I'll show that my other one. 1 Kings 8. Let me get my, get my sword out. Yeah, get your, get your sword out, because that is not an Israelite, brother. 1 Kings 8. Y'all got it all mixed up. Moreover, concerning a stranger that is not of thy people is Israel. So is this an Israelite? That's, that's a stranger that's not that's of an thy actual, people. That's an actual, actual heathen. heathen of another that's nation. A, no, it's not, brother. Yes, it is. It's not. That's it's a not. heathen. It's it's not. Read it again. The split Read it happened again. in First Kings Read it again. 10. Read this First Kings 8, the split Read didn't happen Read yet. Read it again. When, when did the Read split? Read it again, brother. This is First Kings 8, brother. When, uh, when did the split? Oh, wow. Yeah, but you, what, what verse? What verse? First Kings 8 and go to 41. You got to call it out, man. All right, question. When did the split happen? John the Cherub on the river. First Kings 10. Right. This is before that. Okay. This but, is before that. But even still. As a matter of fact, let's still, go to the law. But even, but even still, there were Israelites, there were Israel who were, who were known as strangers. Brother, right? Is, Can you agree with that? This is the law before the split. This is numbers. Go ahead. One ordinance shall be for you of the congregation and also for the stranger that sojourneth with you. Yeah, and ordinance. That is someone who was an Israelite. No, that's brother, you listen, listen, oh man. That's you gotta understand. This is before the split. Listen, that's that is very false. Who is an Israelite who is out or holding somebody So this, this law, one law and one manner shall be for you and for the stranger right. that sojourns with you. Right. That's not an so, Israelite. So, so you got a lot of things. Let me, let me ask you this, man. Right? Let me ask you this. So are you, are you saying that. I'm not saying that. All right. Are you, but you came up and you're saying that you asked me. Do, uh, do we preach salvation is only to the Israelites, right? The Israelites, correct. Right. That's that's that was your question. Yes. And I said yes. All right. So now, let's go. Let, let's go right now from that point. Let's figure out who salvation was given to. Mm. I just read it here. All right. You know what? All right. Fine. Fine. Right. Who salvation oh, given to? Yes. Yeah, right. yeah. We get it on. We get it on. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's, it's about to get crazy, guys. Right. I, I came here to tear up shop. Okay. We'll tear it All up, right. Man. Go, uh, matter of fact, I'm gonna have to look for it. Go to Isaiah 49:6. Okay. Because that's gonna kill you. That's an Israelite lie. What? Whoa, whoa, said, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Let's, let me, let me. Every get stranger I claim, he says he's don't, an Israelite. Don't that's what you say. Don't, don't, then that's don't say what the scripture would say before. Well, you he's about to read it. He said Isaiah 49. 49 6? says, because that's going to bring up yeah, your people and Gentiles. All right, right. okay. Because I, I just want to listen. We got to slow down here. He's going to run I, I to the it. strangers or the it. Israelites listen, every single just, time. Listen, let's slow it that's down. That's the lie that y'all are all. Let's under. slow it down it's not, it's because not. I, I want to make sure we're all and understanding. He, I want to make sure we're all understanding what's being said because you said that the house of Israel is not is, the Israelites. Is different from the Israelites. Correct. Yes. All right. So. We, we, I proved it in Isaiah, Isaiah 56. You didn't prove it. You didn't prove it. Didn't prove it. Hold on, wait. Can you ready? Every time I bring strangers, he runs and says that's an Israelite. Right. So this is going to kill that. So, read that. Hold on, Isaiah 49. No, no. Let's read that we're first. We're going to read it, but let's, 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 okay, let's slow it down. down huh? Okay, so you're saying this scripture is going to prove that Israelites stranger, weren't known as strangers. No, this is going to prove that the stranger that he keeps running to is different from the Israelites. Read, King, please. Okay. And they could be saved. Okay. okay, Isaiah 49 and 6, you said, right? Yes, sir. Read it. Keep it on. Isaiah 49, matter of fact, I would be that verse 5, right? Isaiah 49 and uh, 5. And now said the Lord, that formed me from Jerusalem to be his servant, to bring Jacob again. Hold on, to wait, him. wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Who's, who's that talking he's about? He's talking about Jacob. No, 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 that's, that's the most high the talking most to high Christ. Talking he's talking Jacob. to Christ oh, about Jacob. Yeah. Yeah, All right, now read it. Uh, God is talking to Christ about Jacob, which are the Israelites. Right, read, read. I'm going to read, read verse 1. Yeah, right? no doubt. All right. All right. And listen, I got love for y'all. All right. And listen, y'all are God's let, people. Let, you know let the scripture come out, please. please. Right, Isaiah 49, verse 1. Listen, O Isles, unto me, and hearken, ye people from far. The Lord hath called me from the womb, from the bowels of my mother, hath he made mention of my name. And he hath made my mouth like a sharp sword. In the shadow of his hand have he hid me, and made me a polished shaft. And his quiver have he hid me, 
And he said unto me, Thou art my servant, O Israel, Correct. in whom I will be glorified. Mm -hmm. What do I do? Yep. No, no, but, 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 yeah, but keep reading it. But, but I, I you can't take a piece. Just keep on reading it, King, and then we're going to talk about it. All right, go ahead. All right, because it's, it's fair. fair. No, I was going to break something down, but go ahead. Yeah. All right, verse 4. Yep. Then I said, I have labored in vain. I have spent my strength with naught, and in vain. Yet surely my judgment is with the Lord, and my work, oh, and my work with my power, or my God. Gotcha. Yep. And now said the Lord, that formed me from the womb to be his servant, to bring Jacob again to him. Hold on, hold on, wait, wait. Who's going to bring Jacob? Christ. Correct. Read it. Watch. Okay. Watch. Okay. okay. Right, right. He's going to bring Jacob. Come Jacob. Who are the Israelites? Now read. Watch. Oh, wait, hold, on. hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Isn't, this is why, isn't that why he, he, he got on the cross? At first, yeah. At first. At first. Which is Mark seven twenty seven. But, 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 but you see how brother, you, you you cut me off to no, break it down. He was trying sorry. to do the same thing. Sorry, sorry. All right. Go ahead, bro. Uh, I'm gonna read it again, verse five. And now said the Lord that formed me from the womb to be His servant, to bring Jacob again to Him, though Israel be not gathered. Hold on. To bring Jacob again. Give me Acts five and three. No, no, no. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, bro. We gonna, we gonna. You uh, came up and asked us, knows, so we gonna deliver. Knows, knows, precept right? upon precept, line upon line. But break that one last so, last but, sentence but down. What's the, what's the, what's the, the end? Like how, the how end far... is the Gentiles and Israelites are gonna be saved. So, but, but well, what I'm asking, yeah, yeah, what yeah, I'm asking, yeah, what I'm asking is where, where can we interject to explain what we're reading? Where and what and what part? The last sentence. All right, fair enough. The last sentence of the whole chapter. No, no, no. It ends in six. Six, which is one more verse. Verse six. Okay, I'm gonna go back. I was Isaiah 49. But understand, we're gonna break it down. Yes, sir. There's gonna be times where we stop to break the scripture down. Con. All right, con. All right. Excuse me. Are you an Israelite? Uh, my father's father was a so-called Haitian. Okay, mixed with white people. But on my father's lineage, my my blood is E1B1A. So that's all right. So that's Well, we don't get into. I mean, we don't know what a lot of brothers have their blood type. All right, no, you get into this. You fine. You fine. So 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 you're so you're so you're a Levite. You're a Supposedly. Supposedly. All right, fair enough. Go ahead. Isaiah 49 and 6 for edification. And he said, So you want him to read all of six? No, just six. Just yeah, six. All of the six, six verses. That's what I'm asking. He said the point, I think, is in the last sentence. He Go ahead. Said, no, no. Not. give it what, the give point is give in the first what, verse. Read what he yeah. called. Yep. We, can, we can read verse six. Isaiah 49, verse six. And he said, It is a light thing Ready? that thou shouldest be my servants that raised up the yeah. tribes of yeah. Jacob mm, you guys. and restored the. The 144. Hold on, hold on, bro. We, we do it, and you like, no, no, no. Come on, man. Come on. Let's, let's be fair and equitable. Sorry about that. I'm going to read it again. Sorry, you're right. And he said, It is a light thing that thou should be my servants to raise up the tribes of Jacob and to restore the preserved of Israel. Mm. And I, I will also give thee for a light to the Gentiles that thou mayest be salvation until the end of the earth. Who's right. the tribes of Jacob? Ho hold on, hold on. Let's slow down, brother. You, you got us, right? Thank you. Let, hold you on. Right let's, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Let's go to 2 Corinthians 12. Right. And y'all want to help me out? 2 so? Corinthians 12. Because he said, a light to the Gentiles, right? Yeah. And so, to the tribe hold, hold of, hold of on. Jacob. Hold on, that's that's right. Right. Hold on, hold on. So let me let me ask you. Yeah. Uh, uh, the tribe of the tribe of Jacob are they the Gentiles? They were called Gentiles, but they're Is, but they, they're not they, the bloodline. Were right? the Israelites? Were the Israelites Gentiles? Called Gentiles. They were called Gentiles. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So how do you distinguish whether or not it's talking about Israelites here or heathens or other or the nations? Heathens. Because that verse says the tribes of Jacob. Mm -hmm. And the, the Gentiles. Well, well, but hold on. A Gentile is going to be somebody that's not practicing or, or living on the, in the land or doing according to the law of the Lord. So they're going to be foreigners the, okay. from the commonwealth of Israel. And that's now, why it's now, to restore the pre right, preserved. Right, to restore, restore, to, restore, to bring it back again to the people yeah, whom restore, it belonged to. Oh, now read, read that. Read, yeah. I, got the, I got the definition for Jesus. Hold, hold that, hold that, read that. Yep. Uh, this is uh, First Corinthians chapter twelve. Who wrote Corinthians? Paul. Paul. Let's Paul. get right to it. Paul, yeah. Now listen, listen to what he says because we we go through this time after time. Paul, the apostle Paul, was the apostle to the to the Gentiles, mm -hmm. right? So now, was Paul going to everybody outside of the children of Israel? Yes, correct. Oh. Read that. Uh -huh. It says now concerning spiritual gifts, brethren. Now he's talking to who is he talking to right here? Concerning spiritual gifts, brethren. Right, Who is he talking to? To his, his people. His people. The Israelites? Correct, yes. Read on. Uh huh. It says, I would not have you ignorant. Go ahead. Ye know that ye were Gentiles. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hit the pump the brakes. Pump the brakes. Let's 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 examine this. Let's examine this. So if Paul was talking to his people, 
whom you just said who were Israelites, why is he calling them? Why did he say to them, you know that you were Gentiles? Because ready? Because when he says, no, hold on, wait. When he said, we for all our fathers passed under the cloud, right? Was that just Israelites or was that a mixed multitude too? That was Israel. With the mixed multitude. You can't lie, which, which is Israel. Which was Israel. The mixed multitude was Israel too? Yes. yes. Everybody is Israel. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We can prove that going we can prove that going to Revelation the chapter chapter seven. So the mixed multitude was Matter of fact, someone pull that up on record. Hold on, hold on. We're gonna show you, bro. We're gonna show you. So somebody somebody bring up Genesis uh the seventh chapter in the blue letter. Genesis seventh chapter in the blue letter. And I believe it's first um might be verse six or seven, maybe. You got that corral, brother, you can't make everybody an Israelite, brother. You can't do that. Hold on, hold on. Making everybody an Israelite. We're not he, trying to make everybody. He an said the mixed multitude of Israel. Well, we're gonna read it. We're gonna read it. We're gonna read it. We're gonna read it. So, matter of fact, would you, would you still got that? In, uh, Corinthians. Yeah, yeah, Corinthians. Yeah. Read yeah. that from the top. Yeah. Come, come. Um, it says now concerning spiritual gifts, brethren, I will not have you ignorant. Right. Ye, ye know that ye were Gentiles carried away onto these dumb idols, even as ye were led. So pause it right there. So he's called, he said you were Gentiles carried away unto these dumb idols because they was practicing after the customs, the customs of the other people, but they were Israelites. That's right. So gotcha. the apostle okay. Paul, and when you go to, give me Proverbs so, right, King, 11 and 1. Question, ready? Yeah, if I pass a law that says, only skinny people could get into the clubs, but you guys were fat, but now you're, you're skinny. It doesn't change. God said Israel and Gentiles. So you can't say, no, no, hold on, wait, wait, wait. Because you can't say because we were gen Gentiles, it's still open for the, the Gentiles. Just because right. you was one, what you don't doesn't mean it stops that the Gentiles. What you don't Gentiles. understand is there's two types of Gentiles. Right, right. There's two types of Gentiles. And what's that in um, John? John, give me that in John. Now check this out. It's going. To, the, the, the question is going to be asked: Whether will he go amongst the Gentiles John to teach the Gentiles? Right, he's going to get it. But, yeah, but those are Gentiles, brother. Because ready, look, look. Acts. You talk about Paul, right? Acts nine fifteen. Jesus said this Christ's words. Go thy way, for Paul is a chosen vessel right, unto me right, to right, bear my name right. before the Gentiles. Right, Who's right, this Gen Gentiles? Exactly. It's talking about the Israelites. And the children of Israel? Right. That's oh, right. Come because on, they're, they're, all one, they're all one group. Nah, dude, 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 all messed up, dude. So he's saying, I sent you to the Gentiles, which are the children of Israel. And the children of Israel. Okay, okay. 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 Shalak, y'all. All right. So, where, where you at? Yeah, Acts, I'll, I'll 19. Yeah. Acts 11 and 19. Okay, yeah, I got it right here. Exactly what Paul was talking about. Right, I got it. I got it right here. Yeah. Acts 11, and I'll start at verse 18. Yeah. Uh, when they heard these things, they, he they held their peace and glorified God, saying, Then have God also to the Gentiles granted repentance unto life. Correct. Now they which were scattered abroad unto um, upon the persecution that rose about Stephen traveled as far as Phoenice and Cyprus and Antioch, preaching the word to none but unto the Jews only, because Paul kept going to the Gentiles. They they weren't trying to hear it. Paul is the same. Paul, that goes Paul. That is Paul. That's all right. He, it says, then that had the Most Paul. High also to the Gentiles granted repentance unto, right. un, uh, right. unto life. Right. Repentance. Who is repentance for? Uh, who was who who the law given to? Right. Hey, the so, law was given to everybody. Oh, oh well, wait, wait, hey, no? hey, let's cut that off right now. We're going to cut it off right now. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. That's all right. That's all right. One law and one man are a people for the Israel and for the stranger. When you, when you, when you go back, under the same law. The law is given to everybody. So when the Lord came right, down to Moses, right? Correct. He told Moses to get the law to who? All right, watch. Well, well let's, uh, let's read it. Okay. As a matter of fact, read on Psalms 147 and 19. No, no, because that's you're talking about. He shows his work. He has not dealt so with. In the nation. Got it's you. Just yeah, because, yeah, but can I, can I tell you why? Because when he deals with the nations, because when he deals with the nations, he deals with them individually. The only nation he dealt with as a whole was Israel. Was the only nation. Okay. All the other nations, he's gonna sip perfect. people perfect. out of those nations. Perfect. 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 The Lord That's said, what God Let me says. ask you this. Let me ask you a quick question, right? Mm -hmm. The Lord said He had a chosen people, right? Correct. Which is everybody. Somebody's feeding them. All right, ready? No, no. Let's go. Chosen people. All the Edomites chosen. No, no. no. So All right, come on. Well, the, Lord, the, Lord, the Lord has a chosen. Amos people. nine twelve. Amos nine. You know, nine twelve. Someone's I mean, feeding you the scriptures. Can I, what? Yeah. Somebody's feeding you. <laughs> <laughs> 
Listen, Amos 9, 12. That they may possess the remnant of Edom and of all the heathen which are called by my name. Those Edomites are called by his name. Who's going to possess them? Yeah, the house of Israel is. You're missing something. You're missing yeah, something. Right? You're yeah. just missing it. Yeah, talk mm -hmm. to you. Go ahead, Elder. So, so I think what's important to note before you even before we even start is mm -hmm. the scriptures from beginning to end was for the children of Israel. That's what I said in the beginning. Where do you guys get that? That's from, from, from the scriptures. All right, ready? Hold on, King. Ready? I'll, I'll Who's you, the I'll, first I'll, people I'll, scattered? I'll, I'm only gonna hold on. Who's one second. I'm gonna people? answer you, okay. but I'm only gonna let you. Ask me a question if I can ask you a question. All right, fair, all right. Fair. He's been fair with it. All right, question. Who was the first people scattered all, all over the earth? I'm, 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 I'm not sure the reference. Genesis 10, it was the okay. it was it was the Gentiles were all scattered. Right. First. So so in, And so, what happened was the Gentiles didn't listen. So he found a lineage not, which that, was it wasn't it wasn't it wasn't it wasn't Gentiles, it was all the nations of the world yeah, that were scattered. Gentiles, right? All the nations, even with, with with even the chosen line in there. All the nations were separated from each other in, in Genesis the Chimp Chapter. Even going back to the Tower of Babel. Yeah, that's, yeah, right. that's, that's what we're talking that's about. That's what Genesis right. the Chimp Chapter right. said. That was the first Babel. people scattered. All, all, all the, changed their language hold on, but hold on. changed all their culture. Why, why were the nations separated from each other? Because they were trying to um, overthrow God. No. They, yeah, were they, were. they were separated from each other because the Heavenly Father had one chosen line right. out of all those nations right. and people. That's right. right. So when you when you go into, when you, when you, you said you let me answer. So when you go into this, this, this separation that happens, right? Mm -hmm. Out of Ham, Shem, and Japheth, yep. who was the, who was the chosen line? You're talking about Shem, Eber, right. and all that. Right. But what were they chosen for though? They were for Christ. Christ. No, they were, of, of course. For of Christ, course. dude, not of for course. them. Of course, they were Christ. chosen for him, for him uh, ultimately. Yeah. But that that chosen line, because when you when you go into Romans the eighth chapter, yeah. it talks about the the the, the son, right? Yep. Yeah. But it also talks about a people being joint heirs with the son. Which, so yes, which are who? Which are the Israelites? Which are the Israelites? All right. So who are the saints? The saints are the Israelites. Israelites. So who are joint heirs with the saints? The Israelites. Israelites. Oh, you guys are bugging, dude. Y'all are saying everybody is, is no, Israel. No, we're no, saying no. the scriptures are talking about Israel. All right, ready? So who is who is Pontius Pilate? Is it is it is Pontius he a, is Pilate? Is so why did Jesus say y'all got a worse punishment than him? John 9, 19. They did John 19. Right. Christ we looked at the Edomite and, and said, "My people are going to get punished worse than you." Yeah. Right. Just, just so like an Edomite. Right. Just like, just like if you have children, Come you're going to punish your children more than you punish their friends because they should know yeah, better. But I thought Edomites are all going to be destroyed. Well, they, they they so to how you're going to get a worse punishment than a person is going to get destroyed? So what's your, that's logic. That's that's doesn't, that, hold on, that logic doesn't doesn't make any sense. So right. just 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 yeah. like when you have a ch when you have a son and he has a group of friends, you're not gonna punish them. You're gonna punish your son worse for the, the thing that they did as a group because yeah, it's your God son. Said he's gonna show you in the lake of fire. That's what Christ said. Say, say that again. Christ said Matthew eight that the Israelites is gonna be cast out into outer darkness for killing them. Yeah, yeah. You don't. You don't. You're not. You don't. You and that's a, facts. You have a fundamental misunderstanding of the scripture. So what we we'll do is this. What we we'll do is this. Can you go? Christ said. For the children of the kingdom, which is you guys, shall be cast out into our... Why? Because y'all backstabbed them. Y'all so, put them yeah, in the cross. Y'all laughed. Y'all made gold gods, right? Now you're now you're trying to push all the Gentiles out. And y'all are saying y'all self a failure. Dude. All right, fair enough. So let me, let me ask you a question. Go to, go to Matthew uh, 13 and 33. Let's go. And, and read that to me. Let's go, man. Because y'all getting set up for the okie doke. All right, Matthew. Let's go. Now what's what's the point? No, I, I want you to read it, the and then, right. then and then what, after you read it, I want you to explain it to me. Right. And this is my new Bible from like a month ago. All right, All right. So hold on. fair enough. Them pages right. sound crisp. No, I know, dude. I just, I just got it. That's All right, right. So, no, so no, Matthew's no, no. thirteen. What? Oh, and look, thirty-three. The Queen of Sheba's judging y'all. The men of Nineveh are gonna, 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 gonna judge y'all. Okay. Matthew thirteen and thirty-three. Thirteen and thirty-three. Another parable. Spoke he unto them, the kingdom of heaven is like unto leaven, which a woman took and hid in three measures of meal till the whole was leavened. What's, what does that mean? But I don't know. That is the, the kingdom of heaven is like un, unto leaven, yep. which is which a woman took and hid in three measures of meal till the whole was leavened. Break what does it that down. mean? Break, break no, down. I want you to break it down. That's I why mean, I asked you to read it. The woman or the support. Israelites, right? Read it again. All right. The kingdom of heaven is like unto leaven, which a woman took and hid in three measures of meal yep. till the whole was leavened. So what are the three measures of meal? Tell, tell me, Ken. I'm asking you. 
I'm asking you to break it down. Because if I tell you, you're going to say I'm wrong. I mean, you're just skipping over a verse. No, that's I saying, want you to. Uh, I, want, I didn't skip over anything. A Gentile is going to judge over I want you to all y'all. I want you to read the verse. I want you to read it. To this? I want you to read it. Well, tell me, bro. You don't. You say if you say. I, if, I, I don't know. Okay, oh, sorry, fair enough. Sorry. So the three measures of mill. When you go into the history mm -hmm. of what happened to the children of Israel, how many tribes stayed in the land? Do you know? What two, maybe three? Two, maybe three is yeah. a good answer, gotcha. right? Yeah. So it was it was Judah, Southern Kingdom. Yep, yeah. it was Benjamin, and then the parts of Levi that were with them. Yeah. So when you read this in Matthew 13 and 33, it's saying that they were hid in three measures of milk, right? Mm -hmm. Until the whole was left. So what is what would be the whole in reference to those three? The fullness of the Gentiles. No, that's what it is, bro. No, when you so why why just those three tribes? Because and then the other God is gonna accept them the to other, make y'all the jealous because he's hoping that y'all change. <laughs> so where, 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 where's that scripture at? Okay, ready? He said to make us jealous. <laughs> to make us jealous. Okay, Romans. Yeah, Romans. To make us yeah, jealous. Yeah, Romans. Romans. He knows where I'm going. So, so read it. So Romans read it. Nine, it yeah, Romans nine. nine. It's, it's a, it's a good Start at the top. Listen, I'm comfortable in, in Romans nine. Yeah, that's true. So don't go oh, there, dude. Because I listen. Listen, I could show you where the Gentiles get the glory, get the covenants, and the service hey, of God. Read it. Read it from the top. Really? Read it. Read it from the top. Let me, well, before you read, I just, I just want to say one thing. What you're failing to realize that there are two types of Gentiles. That's what you're trying. No, you're hiding behind that. That's the only lifeline you guys got. That's how do you figure When he goes to John, he tells you. Because I brought you to the book of the law. To the Gentiles? Where God made a law that the strangers are going to understand it. You're hiding I don't behind understand. that. Yes, I don't understand. John, John, just read that. Read that. John 7 and 35. Hold on, hold on, wait. Then said the Jews among where, themselves. Where shall he go? The can, can we let, let him? Can we let the scriptures? We, we can let the scriptures. Why is it important for us to listen? Because that's true. Right. speaking, we that, that, that hurt you. That hurt you. Because he says, "And teach the Gentiles." What did, what did I just say? What did I just say to yeah. make you can say? Can we it let hurts the scriptures us? come yeah. on, brother? Hold on, hold on. What did, what did we just say to, to make you say that hurts? Because that verse hurts you. How? Because it says you're gonna teach the Gentiles. You don't understand the scriptures. You don't understand. No, you're teaching. No, you no, you don't understand the scriptures. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You just don't understand the scriptures. No, you're twisting it to make. No, you don't understand. It. You're a, so, so do, give me a favor. Hold on one second, please, please, bro. If, if you don't mind, yeah, yeah, yeah. can you go to Acts the first chapter in the sixth verse? Let's go. Acts the first chapter. In the sixth verse. He doesn't answer. I, okay, are you gonna right. read it or not? Right. Are you gonna read it or not? <laughs> Got you. Here you go. So he goes. Um, when is he gonna restore it? Right? Are you gonna read, read, the, are you gonna read the verse or not? The former treaties have I made. On the six. On the six. On the six. When they therefore were come together, they asked of him, saying, who's, Lord. Who's the they? Really quick. With the apostles. Okay. Saying, Lord, will thou at this time restore again the kingdom to Israel? Why, why did he say that? Why didn't he answer? He did answer. Where? He, 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 in the next verse, he tells him it's not for them to know the time and the season. But he didn't answer. He didn't answer. That's, that's, that is an answer. That's the weakest thing you got. That, that's no, it. that's not. I'm not that, done. That's it. That's I'm not done. done. Yes. What does it mean? Why would they say that? What it means is this. I'm, I'm, I'm sure. No, no, no. What, hold on, hold on. Let's read it again. Because the house of Israel is everybody who converts becomes the house of Israel. No, no. there's no scripture that says that. There's no scripture that says that. All right, so Esther 9, 12, many people of the land became... Fair enough, fair enough. Break, break that Fair down. enough. No, you'll read that to us. Headshot. Read that. Many no, people of the land became Jews. You're getting caught. You're getting caught. Read it. No, read it. No, but you... No, so read it. Read what you just Brother, quoted. You just got shot with that. Read what you just quoted. Oh, you don't want to read it? You don't want to read it? No, no, no. Read what you just quoted. What you just quoted. What you just quoted. Okay, Esther 9. Yeah. You see, you see what happens while well, he's finding what he's looking for. You see what happens is that we've been hitting him with scriptures. No, no, he but, actually. But he wants to divert and give a headshot to a brother and, 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 and call no, no, the case no, brother, closed. Yeah, he but said, you never, you, never, you, never, read it? you never broke down the three measures of meal. Then that's coming next. Then hold on. He mentioned spiritual Israel does not exist. It doesn't. And many people of the land are these no, Israelites or are these heathen? Read it. Well, question: Are these Israelites? Chapter Esther 9 12. I mean, uh, 9 and 17. 9 and, 17. and many people of the land became Jews. Esther How can you become a Jew? No, hold on, that's not. You said Esther 9 and what? 17? 9 and 17. 9 and 17. Can you read that from the top? No, it doesn't say that. And many people of the land became Jews okay. for the fear of the Jews fell upon them. Okay, can we, That's a spiritual Jew, can brother. Go, That's what go, happened. Can we go to Ezra the fourth chapter? Let's Ezra, go to Ezra, Ezra, Ezra the fourth chapter. I want, I want him to read it. Okay. I want him to read it. Ezra, Ezra four and one. 
Romans Rule 4. It's right here. You got the bookmark Israel. right here. Israel, Israel and not to mention, yeah, right here. the Hebrews right here. The Hebrews were very protective of their laws. Mm. They were very protective of yeah, their laws. Yeah, under the but, sixth. But, hold on, but this is what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. They weren't going to go out and just put fear in somebody to follow the law. Hold they were on. very protective of the law. Let's, the let's Lord said what? The Lord said what? This verse is going to kill that whole <laughs> Moses law. You're not going to go to Ezra's... Well, no, it's coming right now. Just wait one, one second. Because I'm going to prove to you that the Whoa, that the Moses law is it's done it's away okay, with. It's okay. It's okay. Let, let him read what he wants yeah, to read. Because, no, because this Can you call it out? Should I go follow Matthew you? 17. Matthew 17. So y'all stop doing that 613 right after this. 613. You're talking about the laws. Yeah, don't buy Moses law. Because y'all follow Moses. Ready? You don't follow Moses? Heck no. I follow not? Christ. Okay. Moses is the past. So they, so That's they, the so old they, girl. They, 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 they cry, did Christ follow the, the, the no. law? And God said, don't. He Ready? said he came to the law. He the law. God said, don't follow Moses. So, on, Ready? On, Let's on, hear God say because we're, now we're, change, we're changing the topic, and it's, 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 it's no, what we're trying to do. I'm going to prove to you Hold on. Hold on one second. Hold on one second. Was was the when the world caused Christ, was he perfect? Yeah, he was perfect. Based on what? Based on his actions. Right. So what actions? What actions? What? Was what the act Mosaic law? Right. So how can you say it's the because old right? law? Because oh, God, hold on. Hold on one second. Hold on one second. Get it's not, I'm not, no, I'm just trying to answer this a question. We were under the Mosaic law until Christ right. he was came crucified. Correct. After that, it's over. No, that's, 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 not true. That, that's what God said. So, can, so, can, so when, is it okay to commit adultery? Can I read this? No, it's not. Why not? Why? Because I love my brother. It's so, but is, it, is it okay to commit adultery? Christ said there's two laws. You said the law was God done away with. Love thy neighbor as thyself. Oh, man. If is the law done away with? Is the law done away with? Just answer the can question. I, can I answer read the it? question? Yes, 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 yes. Yes. So committing adultery is okay now? No, it's not. Because you know why? why? not? Why? Because the law still why? stands. Why? Because Jesus gave you the uh, uh, freedom to not have to do it. But he said, don't use it as an occasion to the flesh. All right, so, like, so you can do it. You can do it, but don't but get crazy with it. This girl or you can, so you're saying, so, you so, you're saying, so you're saying, so you're right. saying you can do it, just don't get crazy about it. Well, let's hear what God says. Was I ready? <laughs> can I read yeah, it? Sorry, yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. All right, this is John chapter, uh, chapter 5, verse 54. How can ye believe which receiveth honor one of another and seek not the honor that cometh from the power only? Do not think that I will accuse you to the Father, there is one that accuses you, even Moses, mm. in whom you trust. Mm. Mm. For had you believed Moses, you would have believed me, for he wrote of me. Right. But ye believe not his writing, how shall you believe my words? Ready? Because what you so, just so, 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 Hold on, wait, wait. Lord Let's see Moses. What, what are you talking about? Can you, can you answer that? Right. Yeah, I'm about to answer that. All right, all right, all right. All right. please, please Ready? do. So hold um, on, before you answer. Because Moses. Hold on, hold on one okay. second. Before you answer with, with, yeah. with, with what you're going to read, yeah. what is he saying here? I'm, I'm about do you know who this is speaking? I'm about to read it. Do you, do, so you're going to read Moses that same verse? speaking about Christ. Are you going to read the same verse I'm going to speak to where he's getting it from okay. in the Old Fair Testament. Enough. Fair enough. All right? Um, Call it out. Call it out. No, that's all right. That's all right. There's a verse where Moses says, um, God is going to send a new person that you should follow. I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting for you. Right. I'm waiting for you. you said you had it. You got it. Got it. This if, you can't, if you can't find it, please explain what he what he read. Can you read that again one more time while he's looking for it? You need what he's help? looking for? Well, no, read it one more time. The book of John chapter 5 verse 54. I, I got the Holy Spirit. How can you believe which receiveth honor one of another and seek not the honor that cometh from the power only? Mm. This is it right Do here. not think that I will that accuse you to the Father. There's one that accuses Bow. you, even Moses, right in right whom here. you trust. For had ye believed Moses, you would have believed me, for he wrote of me. But you believe not the writings, how shall you believe my words? All right, ready? This is what he's, he's talking about. And Moses said, Where you at? Where you at, brother? Yeah, call De me. Deuteronomy 18, 15. Okay. The Lord thy God will raise up to thee a prophet. Who? Christ. <laughs> From the midst of thee, of thy brethren, like unto me, unto him you shall hearken. Who are the so brethren? We're not hold following on, Moses. Hold on we're following Christ. Hold on, hold on a second. On. But now let's let's hear God say it. Watch. Hold, can, can I can I ask you a question? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So is that the only verse that the, that Moses wrote about uh, the Lord? Is that the only verse? Hold on, wait, brother. <laughs> hold on, wait, because Christ says to leave that six thirteen all alone. No, I don't want to be heard. This is scripture, is brother. Where you come from anyway, brother? Right. Where I come from? Where you come from? No, no, I'm saying, how'd you know we were here? Trust me, I follow all, all y'all. All right, ready? Okay. 
after six days, this is what's going to put an end. Hold on, wait, brother. This puts an end to the 613 is over, meaning you're free to do what you want. You're free to do what Hold on, wait. You're finished. Just don't hurt another person. And don't hurt. Sound yeah. Like Satan All right, ready? Okay, ready? That's what Alistair Crowley said. And after six person. days, do what you want, Jesus you took Peter, nobody. James. Ain't that what Alistair Crowley said? Do it that way. So we're not under liberty? You are under liberty. So it what does that mean? It mean oh, I'll explain to you. We're under grace. So be, that liberty gives us grace. And the grace is not to say that you don't have to do it anymore. It just gives you a time to do it the right way. This is what this is what the council was in Acts 15. That's right. The council in Acts 15, Acts 15 was for the Gentiles. Brother, the, no, the to council not force them to do any laws. No, 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 no. Let's go to Acts 15. Yes, let's go to Acts 15. Yeah, all messed up. No, man. you're messed up. Yeah, yeah. You right, messed up. First, this is this, before you go to yeah, I'm, 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 I'm close to not listening to him at all because you're Sorry. not listening. You know, we got to be got to be balanced. Twisting. There's no balance. All right, well, all right. Because well, I, can, I, can, can I read no, this one? one second. Okay, one okay. second. Okay. Let's set ground rules. Okay. When you talk, we listen. So we want the same respect. That's right. That has to be the ground rules, or we can't do this anymore. Right. This is because it's right now it's one sided. You got to listen. So you get you'll get your chance to read what you want to read, but you got to listen afterwards. All right, fair enough. fair enough. Now, we're going to read the scripture. You're going to listen, mm -hmm. and then you can go uh, again. That's okay, right. fair enough. That's the ground rules from this point forward. Go if you city. break those ground rules, we're not going to listen to you no more. Right. All right, let's go. Romans chapter 6, verse 1. What shall we say then? Shall we continue in sin that grace may abound? Right. God forbid. How shall we that we are dead to sin live any longer? Right. Know ye not that so, uh, so many of us... As we're baptized unto Yahweh Shai, we're baptized unto his death. Mm -hmm. Can I get this? Now, 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 what is this saying? What is this saying? Well, being being baptized to. He wasn't to listening. Death? Read it again. No, I was you listening. Know you, what, you were what ready, for the, next, we you were ready for the next thing you said. Shall we continue in sin that grace may abound? God forbid. Now, what does that mean? That means is he's not giving you a license to sin. Correct. That's what that's trying so to say. So then that means it's still there. It's not there, brother. I'm so what, 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 are you saying? You're saying two different. Do you no, realize that? Can I, can do I, you I, realize you're saying two different no, things? You're not you can't say you're free from right, doing ready, it and then ready? say you let's can say, if you want to. Let's say that's what you're saying. Right, ready? Let's say you're 15, 16, 17, right? I hope this your analogy parents give you rules. Yeah, I'm not the best talker. So no, no, no. It's okay, but when you you're use 15, your analogy, 16, they have to make 17, sense. your parents give you rules. You can't have more weed in my crib. Don't bring no chicks to the house. Blasey, blasey. When you turn 18, your dad goes, you know what? You're, 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 you're a man Poor now. Hold on, wait, wait. Uh, hold on, wait. Support now. Hold on, wait. He's, he's a man now. I'm not gonna tell you what to do. You already have it in your heart what to do. That's all it is. No, that's wrong. Yeah, you're way off. That's wrong. Well, then let me read what God. So let me. I'm gonna ask you this question again. Was 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 the one the world called Jesus Christ? Was he was he perfect? Yeah. Based on what? Based on the law. How, so how can we say it's done? Because the and law. And then he was, was then he was hung on the cross, right? As a, as what? When he was hung on the cross, what was he hung up there as? Sacrificial lamb. Was he was he hung up there as a sacrifice? Yes. What is the what is where does sacrifice come from? comes from the law. Right. So his whole existence can I, to can give I us forgiveness now? is is the is, the is, is being practiced us by the law. It was to set us free from the bondage of the carnal Correct. law, brother. We, Correct. We're not under that. Correct. Now, let me read was, this. What is the carnal law? You the can't say something and then stop. The, the carnal law is because when you just let's can we let's I'm going to get a scripture. Good, brother. Let's go to Matthew the 23rd chapter. This, this right I'm going to I'm going to explain what the carnal law is. The carnal law is not just to say it's the law so it's carnal because there's benefit to the law. Cuz he he Paul even asked the question, what benefit then have the Jew? Much in every way. So there's a benefit to the law. So we can't say it's just carnal just because what made it carnal is because people would do this. I, I, I want to do this thing. Let me sacrifice this thing and then go do it. That's what makes it carnal. But the difference is with the Lord Yahweh Shai is now there's the spirit of the law, which means that now I want to keep the law as opposed to I'm keeping it just because. Matthew right. 23 and 1. No, I'm, I'm going to explain what Then spake, then spake Yahweh Shai to the multitude and to his disciples, saying, The scribes and the Pharisees sit in Moses' seat. Right. All therefore whatsoever they bid you observe. Why did he say that to them? This is the, this is the Lord, the one the world calls Christ. This is him ta talking to them. Read that from the top again. Come on. I'll, I'll start at verse 2. The scribes and the Pharisees sit in Moses' seat. Right. All therefore whatsoever they bid you observe. Right. That observe right. and do. So what they sit in Moses' seat. Mm -hmm. They are the priests. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. So if they tell you to keep the law, then do that. Mm -hmm. Why would he say that? Mm -hmm. Why would he say that if, if he, it was done away if, with? If it was done away with or if he understood that he was the one that was going to do away with it. Right. Why would he say that? Right. Go ahead. Con. It says, 
after their works, for they say and do not. Right. For they bend, for they bind heavy burdens and grievous to be born. Right. This is the carnality of the law. To be to 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 use it mm -hmm. to, to, to bolster up, yourself up. Yourself up. Just like when when the, when the, when the, when you gave the example, I'm not like this publican. I, I fast this many times, right, right. I pay my tithes, right. I do this, I do that. Right. That's the carnality of the right, law, right. not just the law itself. It's the, it's the person and misusing it mm -hmm. because the law has benefit. And lay them on men's shoulders, but they themselves will not move them with one of their right. fingers. So, and as you continue on, what did he call them over and over and over again? Mm -hmm. Hypocrites. 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 Right. Over Hypocrites. and over and over again. That was the problem with the law, not the law itself. The problem with the law was the people misusing right. the law to make, the put people. themselves in a position. I'm a Pharisee. I mm. administer the law. I'm, mm. I'm this person. So the Lord, that's what he came to remove. Right. The pride in the law. No, Go really ahead. Good. Keep on. Uh, Romans chapter 3, verse 31. Which, 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 which is important to note, right? Because this is why you have the, the, the Israelites had to fall away and become Gentiles so that all can receive that mercy right. from this law. Right. 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 From right. the hypocrisy of the right. law. Right. Right. That's why that's important. Keep going. Romans chapter 3, verse 31. Do we then make void the law through faith? Right. God forbid. Right. What does it say? We establish the law. Keep going, bro. Romans chapter 3, verse 31. Do we then make void the law through faith? God forbid. Yay. We establish the law. Right. Because when you when you have faith, right, when you, when you now understand in the spirit of the law, you keep it. You now keep listen. it. No, I'm not, we're not listening to you no more. Oh, Romans see, 8, we're not listening knows, to you. Because he knows no I'm coming Romans back. Romans 8, you, know, you, you weren't listening this whole time. I was listening. No, you weren't. Keep going. But it's the same keep one. Going. The, keep going. Romans 8 keep and 7. Going. For if the first covenant had been faultless, right. mm -hmm. then should no place have been sought for the second. Right. For, for finding fault with right. them. Yeah. He not said. Not the law. Right. Not the law. The misuse that the person Perfect. was going against Perfect. the law. Perfect. So the law still stands. The law doesn't. All of a sudden. Dude, I got a whole clip ready. Are you all listen, over head? Are you the, law doesn't, the law doesn't all of a sudden go away. Right. Because even the Lord Yahweh Shai, who is who is so-called, as the scriptures say, let me say it that way, freeing us from the law, he did so under the law right. as a sacrifice. Right. Right. He had to be perfect, right. which is the same law as yeah. getting a, a lamb that was unspotted. That's right. That's right. When, when he was hung, he couldn't have his legs broken under the same law. Right. Right. Yep. So the law is not done. And this is why, the reason why it's important to note this, because there would be Israelites that had no clue about what this law was. Right. Right. So how could they now receive salvation? But if the Lord came to kill right. their, their, the, 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 the staunchness yep. and the strictness of yep. the law. Yep. Right. Keep going. Matthew chapter 10, verse 34. Think not that I'm come to send peace on us. Right. Like it, um, Ooh, that was wrong. I want to think now I come to destroy the law. Yeah, Matthew 5, yeah, yeah, Matthew right. 5. Matthew 5. Uh, this is Matthew 5, verse 17. Yep. It says, Think not that I am come to destroy the law or the prophets. Right. I am come to destroy. I, I, I come can't. Not to I am not right. come to destroy, right. but to fulfill. But to fulfill. Like, when you fulfill something, that means you do it. That's right. Perfect. To a completion. Right. right. To a completion. Right. So, 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 so bless it. Now we, now we go to the scriptures that explain the history of, of, let's go back to Isaiah 49. I'm, I'm sorry, bro. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm, yes. I'm, forgive me. No, forgive me. No, I'll be forgive me. So this is, um, if you, if you can listen to this, yes, right? Sir. Yes, sir. This is, uh, somebody, John, why he's, somebody go back to Isaiah 49. John, and, and we're going to start at, I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Yeah, we're going to, we're going to, we're going to, um, we're going to, we're going to start at six where he started, but then we're going to stop and go back to the first verse of 49. Right. right. This is, um, this is John eight and six, right? Yep. This, they said, tempting him, that they might this, have to this, accuse this is, him. This is a one West thing. We just made this stuff up. We just made this, this stuff up. Let's go, let's go. Right, right, right. Go ahead. This, they said, tempting him, that they might have to accuse him, but Jesus stood down and with his finger wrote on the ground mm. as though he heard them not. Mm. So when they continued asking him, he lifted up himself and said unto him, said unto them, wow. he that is without sin among you, let him first cast a stone at her, right? Yep. And again, he stooped down and wrote on the ground. And they which heard it, being convicted by their own conscience, mm. went out one by one, beginning at the elders, even unto the last. Mm. And Jesus was left alone and the woman standing in the mm. midst. When Jesus had lifted up himself and it's saw it's none it's but the woman, point. he said unto her, Woman, 
Where are those thine accusers? Right. Hath no man condemned thee? Right. She said, No man, Lord. And Jesus said unto her, Neither do I condemn thee. Neither do I condemn now this go, is. This, the, yeah, the, I knew it. Go ahead, bro. Hit it. Hit it. I'm go. Excited, listen. Brother. Go and sin no, no more. more. Now, what now, why? Why would he say go and sin no more? Go and sin no why, more. Why wouldn't he just say you good? You, you good? Go, 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 I'm here. I'm here. I got you. Go on the way. Gave it a gun in the wing. Go on the way. Sorry, buddy. This is the thing. I don't think. I don't think. Business, baby girl. You all right? I don't think he know what the definition of a sin is. No, he 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 broke it down. He broke it down. Let's go back to Isaiah 49. Okay. Let's go back to this Isaiah. Is the 49. book of Isaiah, chapter 49, so verse 6. So we can six. get a complete picture. This is just an Israelite Christian right here. We're going to get the complete <laughs> picture. Go ahead. Right. Isaiah 49, verse 6. And he said, It is a light thing that thou shouldest be my servant, uh, thou should be my servant to rise up the tribes of Jacob right. and to restore the preserves of Israel. Yep. I will also give thee for a light to the Gentiles. Yep. That thou mightest be my salvation right. unto the end of the now, earth. Now for him, boom, bust it. That's it. Right. Because it says Israel and it says Gentile. Gentile. Let's shot. go to let's head, head shot. <laughs> Let's go to the first verse. Isaiah chapter 49, <laughs> verse 1. Listen, O owls, yep. unto me. So can you can you go to Isaiah 11? 11 and 11? Yep, 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 yep. Go ahead. And, and hearken. Somebody, and somebody, somebody go to Isaiah 1 and 1. What, hold, is that Isaiah 1 and 1? Do the morning, do the morning. Oh, uh, where it says, uh, my people doth not consider? Yep, yep, yep. Isaiah, 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 Isaiah 1 and 3 and 4. 1 and 3. Yeah, hit me. Some, get that. Okay. You get Isaiah 11. Got it. Hey, we're yeah. going to continue here. Come on. Start the top again. Yeah. Isaiah 49 and 1. Listen, O owls, unto me, and hearken, ye people from afar. Ye people from afar. Right, so this is, is he talking about Gentiles or is he talking about Israelites? We're gonna find out. Yahweh have called me from the womb, from the bowels of my mother, as he made me mention my name. And he made my mouth like a sharp sword in the shadows of his hand, as he hid me and made me a polished shaft yep. in his quiver, as he hid me yep. and said unto me, Thou art my servant, O Israel. And who? So he's talking about people from far. Yep. He's talking about the people from the Isles, but then he says, "You Israel." So, so where, where's the distinction? You, you gotta, you, you gotta catch it. We can't just be out here shooting headshots. Right, 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 you, right, what right, happens right. is the head is small. You might shoot a baby. So you gotta pay attention. You gotta be thorough. Keep going. Con. Um, read, read that verse again that you just read. Slow. Con. He said unto me, "Thou art my servant, O Israel." Mm -hmm. In whom I will be glorified. In whom I will be glorified. What is the glory? The glory is the kingdom of heaven. Yes, that's right. The glory is being a joint heir with the Lord Yahweh Shai. His people. Right. His that that's the glory yep. to rule the whole earth. His chosen people. Right now, that's when you right. let's when you go to when you go to Revelation the second chapter, it says, He who keepeth my works unto the to, to the, the end, end will I give a, a rod of iron and, and I will give him power over, over the, the nations. nations. Why would it say that? Why would why would he give those those people right. power over the right. other nations. That's why would he do that? If, if everybody was, if, if it was for everybody, everybody why would he give this one nation power over the other yeah, nation? Why would he do that? Right. Right. And we know it's talking about Israel right. because when you go to the seventh right. chapter, it's, right. it tells you what that governing body is going to be. Right. Or if the, lo if the Lord loved everybody, right. Right. Loved, why would he? Why, have, why, why would he have another why people? Have, why not have like, beat why somebody else? else is right. And then six thousand yeah. from right. another nation. Listen, and listen, you know how easy it is for the Lord to snap his fingers and everybody right here be loved. Why is he going to have to? Destroy this place. Yeah, right. right. What's, what's the hey, why do you separate the nations yeah. during the time of the time? Right. Right. We, we, we talked to you about that. Why, 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 why even have uh, promises to the fathers? Right. Right. Why even do that? And then not keep your promise. Right. And, then, and then break your promise. Right. Break the whole promise. Of, what kind of God are you? Right. And you, you make said, a promise. There's nobody you, strong enough why to fear upon my own name. Right. Right. I turn around and break it. Why even have a chosen people? Right. What's the point? What's the rod of might? Right over his head. This is Isaiah. I'm going to start at 10. This, this is the dagger. This is going to be a headshot. <laughs> Isaiah 11 and 10. It says, And in that day, uh, in that day shall be a root of Jesse, which will stand for as an ensign for the people. Right. To it shall the Gentiles seek, right. and his rest shall be glorious. That's right. We're going to keep reading. We're going to keep reading. Exactly right. Exactly right. And it shall come to pass in that day that the Lord shall set his hand uh, to pick up the on, of it should come to Judah. pass in that day that the Lord shall set his hand again a second time to recover the remnant of his people, which shall be left from 
Assyria, Assyria, and from Egypt, Egypt, and from Petros, right. and from Cush, right. and from Elam, right. and from Shinar, right. and from Hamath, right. and from the Isles of, of the, the Sea. So when you go, when you go to Isaiah 49, he right, right. The verses said the, the people in the Isles, right, right. right. people from right. far, right, right, right. 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 Now, now, real quick, real quick. The reason why he mentioned the Gentiles because those Israelites who were in these lands were known as Gentiles. And we and, and the Apostle Paul had to go out and kick that word and preach that word to bring them back. And this is why the Apostle Paul said, You once knew, you once were Gentiles, carried away unto these dumb idols. Pacros, Kush, Elam, Hamath, they were carried away into them dumb idols. So going back full circle, you ask the question, is it only for the Israelites? You goddamn right it's only for the Israelites. Because you he mentioned the root of Jesse. So why is the book of Matthew? I want to read this real quick, right? Matthew 101, the generation of Yahweh Shai, the yeah. son of David, yeah. the son of Abraham. Yeah. Abraham begot Isaac, and Isaac begot Jacob, and Jacob begot Judas, his brethren. Uh, Judas, his brethren. And Judas begot uh, Pharisees, and Zara, and Tamar, and Pharisees begot Esgram, and Esgram begot Abram, and Abram begot Abin. Uh, uh, what's that? Yeah. Abinda? You see? Yeah, yeah. That's, that's, a, you know, that's a whole lot of names. Yeah. 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 That's a whole lot of names. Jump right to the right. point. And, and first, verse, I jump to five. And Solomon begot Boaz of Arab, and Boaz begot Obed of Ruth, and Obed begot Jesse, and Jesse begot David the king, and David the king begot Solomon, and her, and there was five wives, and Solomon begot. So here's the point there. This line all this line goes all, all the way, way back to Yahweh Shai, which That's goes to back to uh Abraham, Isaac, and right. Jacob. Can I get which the line was, was yeah, promised? Yeah, can I get this? Let me let me get this. I'm gonna get right to the points because we know who's talking, who the Lord is right, talking right, right, to. Right, right. I'm gonna start at verse 21. This is John 4 and uh 20. I'll start at 17. It says, The woman answered and said, I have no husband. And Yahweh Shai said, I have no husband. Right, he says, Thou hast said well, I have no husband. Right, right. For thou hast had five husbands, right, right. and whom whom thou hast now is not thy husband. Right. And that says thou truly. Right. The woman said unto him, Sir, I perceive that thou art a prophet. Our fathers worshipped in this mountain, and ye say that Jerusalem is the place where men are to worship. Yahweh shall answer this unto her, Woman, believe me, the hour cometh. When ye shall neither in this mountain, mountain nor at Jerusalem worship the Father. That's right. Ye worship, ye you know, know not what. what. Mm. We, we know, know what we worship, for, for salvation, salvation is of the Jews. Jews. Now, let me, now let me say this, let me say this. Now this lady, this lady truly believed. She believed that she was an Israelite. She believed that she was of the people. And he said, wait a minute. So with the logic being made throughout this whole world in this time period, why couldn't she make it into the kingdom? Why can't she worship the Father if it was for everybody? Mm -hmm. That's the question. That's the question. That's the question. I'll be back next time. You know what I'm saying? All right. 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 One more thing. One more thing. Uh -huh. Now, just real quick, so, just real quick, a switch back, right? He said, uh, "Thou hast said well, right, that ye have." had five husbands and the one that you have now is not your husband why did he say that because she was worshiping other doctors. no because of the law because he could have said you have grace you have grace woman keep your husband right now you have grace woman but he said that's not your husband because the law was saying the law is still in play okay and the first man that went on you that is your first husband that's your husband because of the law if, because if we had grace right now if we had grace right now right if i meet a woman if i go and meet a woman right now Right? Mm -hmm. She had right now if I go meet a woman, she had she had ten dudes ran up in there, right? Yeah. That woman, right? I take her, right? Mm -hmm. Because of grace, yeah, you know, okay. You know that that's, that, my, lady. that's my lady right now. My but lady. during that time the Lord has said what? What did the Lord say? He said, What? The first man that went into you, that that's is your, your husband husband. because of the law. He's fulfilling the, the law. The right. law. It's the law. Hey, the hey, law. hey yo, all in all, my man, all in all like this. Came up very, you came up very private, courageous. Yo, we here every week. Just come out here to word. You a Levite, bro. You, 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 you a Levite. Yo, just come out here to word, man. You know, and sometimes it takes things like this for somebody to be edified 
because maybe the Lord is trying to shake you out of that, that spell that you yeah, have, man. He's a Levite. He's a Levite. 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 You're very you spell, yeah. Yeah. Hey, and the, big, the bigger picture is you fighting for something that you fighting for well, uh, I'm heathens. For Christ. Well, well, but it's not according. You, Christ is different from Yahweh Shah. We're going out the Bible and we're, we're instructing you out right. the scriptures. We're not giving you precepts that's learned from men. You, you're taught, your precepts are taught from other men and that's they're just wrong. Yeah, they're not right. I'll be back next week because yeah. here is not fair. I'm, I'm getting uh, jumped. Uh, I'm getting uh, jumped. Uh, I'm getting jumped. Uh, Check it out, so check it out. You got the floor, bro. You got the floor. You got the floor. We'll give you the whole shit. You better, hey, hey, leave it alone. The Lord said, the, the light, the, the light shines on the Hey, we have plenty of men. Yeah, how was I was 12 years old going back and forth. But if you a soldier for the Lord, it doesn't matter about being Outnumbered or not. It doesn't matter. Stand on your ground, bro. You, you, got, the, you got the show right now. I'm, I'm also being edified. You know what I mean? Fair enough. I'm listening. Fair enough. I'm listening. We're going to answer this. Simpson or Lawson against a thousand Philistines, That's right. man. That's right. You know? Yeah, Simpson right. and be like, yo, I'm outnumbered. Yeah, Let yeah, me go yeah, back yeah, to get the rest of Israel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I was 12 years old in the temple beating up grown men. But listen, with the word. What, what was being done is not of yeah, us. Yeah, but man. I'm not here. It's I, not I of us. Truth. It was all to the do spirit. get kind of like, you know what I'm saying? Cocky. Amped. Yeah, that's right. But that's, I'm that's not here. Right. Like, I, I got love for y'all. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not here on some. So I'm here to learn, too. Come back, bro. We here every Sunday. Lord willing, you come out and you get edified a little more. You said you've been edified a little bit, so be it. Come out and get more edified. And maybe the Spirit will bless you to understand truth and wisdom and knowledge according to the word of Yahweh Bash Me Out Shai, man. As the scripture says, with all that getting, get understanding. All right, all right, let's set it up, brothers.